everyone. I hope you're all doing really, really well. Um, yeah, welcome back to my channel. This is strange, isn't it? I have not recorded for this video in such a long time. I'm gonna just pop myself down so that I can have a bit of a chat with you before we get on to what the video is gonna be today. Yeah, so it's been absolutely ages. Um, finally, I have got the Disney vlogs out to you pretty much. I think they should all be out by now. And currently, as you're watching this, I should either be in Paris or just on my way back from Paris. And I'm gonna be um, vlogging that. So today's video is gonna be uh, packing. I've got a lot of packing to do. Matt's finished his packing, um, but I'm pretty sure he's still not quite sure about what he wants to bring. Um, and I keep wearing things and then realising, oh, that's really nice, I actually want to take that with me. Like, this skirt I now want to uh, take with me, so I'm going to have to take this off and wash it before we go. So that's a problem. <laughs> but yeah, we're going to be packing today. Um, I am going in two days' time. Today is the 14th of May and it's officially my last day ever of university. I've just finished so that's really exciting and then we're going to go to Disneyland Paris for six days, five nights. So yeah, I'm really really excited. Um, right, so this is kind of going to be a bit of an informal video, a bit of like a vlog. So, currently the bedroom is a state. Here is our current situation. Now this always, always happens whenever we go on holiday. Like everything just becomes like a cluttered mess on the desks and all over the bed and piles and piles and piles of like maybe decisions on what we might bring. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to just try and sort this out. I'm going to clean the bed, make it a clear space for me to get all of my stuff out and I'll see you in a second. Here is outfit number two for Disney. It's just this polka dot uh, lime green, like almost maxi dress for me, but it's meant to be a midi dress. And it's got buttons all the way down. And um, I'm watching Dance Mums while I'm uh, packing because, you know, why not? So, uh, yeah. Okay, and this is outfit number three. So I've got a really like big billowy uh, white blouse, as I can see, and then these cute little tailored turquoisey shorts with, um, if you can see, the, focus, the little ties, got like palm trees and parrots, that's not a parrot, that's a toucan, um, there's a bit of a zebra's bum there, <laughs> I just think they're really cute, these would be really cool for um, Animal Kingdom in Florida actually, but there we go, there's the next outfit and my big thighs but it's fine because you know body positivity and stop and this is outfit number four they will look a little bit better when I've got like accessories and things um, but it's just a plain black sorry my bo my dogs are barking Second, I'm gonna go and check if they're okay. Okay, we're gonna continue because I don't know what's wrong with them. But this is a black t-shirt from Primark. It's just one of those like um, floaty, big, comfy t-shirts. And then I've tied it in a little knot like this. And then this is a midi skirt, one of those like um, ruffly type skirts. They remind me of um, Holly Willoughby. And it's just a really cute like polka dot. I just thought, you know, Minnie Mouse, and I'll wear red lipstick with this look, and I just think it's uh, just really cute. So this skirt is from Silk Fred. Okay, and this is outfit number five. I think this is going to be um, the outfit that I leave in, like the outfit that we travel back home in, just because this is like the most comfortable outfit. We actually fly back like really early in the morning, so technically I only need five outfits for the park and then just like one cozy outfit and this is like a cozy outfit but then still kind of Disney-esque because of the polka dots so we'll see like I really like this outfit and I love these pants so maybe if it's a little bit cooler then one of the skirt options I can switch um to wear the pants if maybe it's a little bit colder or you know I'm just gonna try and like give myself an extra option so this is my extra option and then final outfit is this one here. So I've got a denim paper bag 
um, mini skirt which is from I can't remember. Um, what I'll do is I'll leave all of the details to all of the clothes in the description. Um, I might not have like a link for all of them because um, some things like are from Primark and you can't buy like, things from Primark online. Um, but then I have this gorgeous uh, blouse, off the shoulder blouse, which I just think is the cutest thing with like these like roughly bits on the sleeves. And this is from... Silk Fred? Is this from Silk Fred? No, I don't think it is. I think it's from In The Style. No, ASOS. It's from ASOS. There we go. It's from ASOS. So this is the final one. And this is kind of like um, lighter than the rest of them, I think. So, let me just turn you around. So the plan is that I've got those six outfits there. And then I'm also going to bring a little mini... Um, white and black polka dot dress because that's really lightweight to carry then I'm also going to bring jackets wise I'm going to bring this pink blazer which will go nicely with um, it'll go nicely with this outfit so I want to bring that with me then I'm also going to bring my trusty denim um, like it's almost like acid wash it's really pale denim jacket and then finally if it's like really cold because I, I don't know what it's going to be like with the weather at the moment because um at the moment it says like 20 degrees highest um like eight degrees lowest so you know it's quite quite broad and obviously in the evening I will need a jacket because it will be cold when watching the fireworks um so those are kind of like my two cooler options and then if it gets really really cold something to keep me warm is i have my it needs ironing a lot of this stuff needs ironing like i'm not going to pack it first i'm going to iron it first but just wanted to lay it out um I, i'm going to be taking this coat let me just pop you down for a second i'll pop the coat on so you can see it and just remember this needs ironing So this coat here, let me show you in the mirror, it's all everywhere, like the things aren't quite right, but you can see it's just like a, like a long trench, kind of jazzy coat, um, with like gold buttons and it also has like a belt as well, so you can like really, really cinch yourself in if you want to. And this is just like my night time, maybe we've gone back to the hotel and then I've desperately needed like a coat because I'm really really cold so there we go that is everything that I'm gonna pack um the only other thing that I'm gonna pack which I think I'll be wearing on the plane and maybe if it gets cold but maybe it's, if it's not cold enough for a jacket sorry about that my battery just died so um I'll be bringing this which is a Briar Rose Gold Spirit Jersey from Disney World. I had this delivered for me. And it's just got the sequin Mickey Mouse there. And then on the back, it is fabulous. It says Walt Disney World on it. And it's also in that rose gold sequin as well. So I'll bring that if it is, um, you know, a little bit chilly. I do also have a really, like, bright lime yellow one. But I just don't know if... It's too, well, it is too much. It is the brightest thing ever. Um, it's just, let me get up for you so you can see. It's this here, there's the back and the front. But it's just very, like it's acid yellow. It doesn't look as yellow on camera as it actually is. Like it is, it is, it's like sick yellow. I do like it, don't get me wrong, that's why I bought it. Um, you know what, I am going to pack it because I think it will go nicely if it's a little bit chilly. It'll go nicely with this outfit with the polka dot um, skirt and the black top. I think, yeah, I think that'll go nice. So I'm going to pack that as well. Okay, so here we go. Here are my outfits and what I'm going to pack. 
and now I need to sort that massive pile of stuff and I need to sort everything else that we need to bring. Okay, so now it's quite a lot later in the day because it's taken me absolutely ever to uh, sort this out, but um, I've finally packed, well, I've laid out all of my stuff that I'm gonna pack. Um, Matt's just got back now and he will be sorting out the rest of his stuff. As I said before, he's already got um, everything that he wants to take with him. He just needs to like, you know, finalize it and everything and his toiletries and pajamas and things. And um, So, I'm gonna go through every single thing that I've got out and just explain to you exactly what we've got. So, here is the extent of my packing, which to be fair, I don't think that's too bad. We're going for six days, five nights. Um, so this, of course, is like all the clothes. We've got shoes, toiletries, and then, so, right, okay. So, start off. First thing I'm taking, this is gonna be my handbag for the trip. Now, I do have the Rose Gold um, Minnie Mouse backpack by um, Loungefly but it is full of sequins and when I took it to Disney World with me I could only use it for a few days and then um, it ruined all of my clothes because the sequins would scratch on the fabric. So I'm taking this instead. This is from River Island. Um, it's got a really, really secure clasp on it. I do wish that it did have a zip but unfortunately it doesn't. Um, but yeah, this was from River Island. It was £38 and then I'm taking my Minnie Mouse Loungefly red purse with me um and then in here is pretty much what i what i would carry with me but a couple of extra things as well so i've got a stick on deodorant i've got a pressed powder and powder brush and then a carmex lip balm and a lipstick so that is everything that I will be taking in my little bag here. Let's see if we can just do the clothes with one hand. There we go. Okay. Um, and with that, I've then got my sunglasses case, normal glasses case, and then I'm going to pop a pen in there just in case I need it. Okay. So now we're moving on to the travel outfit. So I'm going to be wearing these little black pumps that were for Primark. I think they were £6. Um, my underwear. <laughs> um, oh, there we go. Underwear there. So I'm going to be wearing the black t-shirt with the spotty skirt. Um, just because I think that's quite a comfortable outfit to travel in. And then I'm going to be wearing this army khaki green um, parka as well. So that's what I'm going to be wearing. Next, we'll move just quickly on to the travel documents. Let me move my underwear out of the way. There we go. I've got a pair of socks as well. They're ready to travel in. So I've got my Minnie Mouse ears. I've got my travel documentation, both of our passports and the um, Euros in there. Okay, and then I'm going to take this pair of Nike trainers and this pair of like heeled um like wedge sandals but they're actually surprisingly really really comfy and these were from where were these from i think these were from new look but they are the brand no doubt but i think they're from new look um next we have our travel adapters i've got five of them um two for our phone chargers one for the um, hair straightener and then two to charge camera batteries and then we've also got two of these like um, circular cylindrical um, power banks and then this flat pack power bank and I prefer the way that this is but I've not like worked out how to use it yet I bought it ages ago and I still haven't worked out how to use it okay next we'll move on to toiletries so I've got the Remington Curl and Straight Confidence, um, which is really, really handy because curling and straightening your hair at the same time, perfect for that. Then razor, um, shaving gel is here. I've got this Impulse Body Spray. I don't like to take perfumes with me 
when I'm on holiday because they're in glass bottles and I just feel like they're gonna break. Um, and also if they do break, that's a lot more expensive. So I just um, bring in this. This is the Tropical Beach and Espresso Body Mist and it's stunning. Then I've got a spray on Dove sensitive deodorant, which is to go with my Dove um, deodorant stick that's in my bag that I'll carry round with me. Then we have the Herbal Essences um, Hydrate Coconut Milk Conditioner and Shampoo. I've got a L'Oreal Elnet um, Satin Hairspray. We've got the Batiste um, Dry Shampoo, a little Vaseline, Coconut Body, um, Body Butter. Uh, we've got this um, Facial Micro Lufa foaming gel, so that's my cleanser. Then the night cream, a bank night cream. This is my little um, spot stuff that I have. And then I've got my mini Foreo, which I use to travel. Then, of course, we've got shower gel. So I've got this um, Dove, um, what one is it? The Shea Butter and Warm Vanilla Body Wash. Next, moving on, we have the Nivea Sun UV Face Q10 Anti-Age and Anti-Pigments. Um, this is SPF 50 and I'm bringing this because I'm so bad with putting um, sun cream on on my face during my holiday. So this is like my actual moisturiser for the holiday as well so I have to put it on before I put makeup on. Um, then we've got some Compede Blister Ankle Patches, some sanitary um, antibacterial hand wipes, we have Pearl Drops um, toothpaste, then Colgate Max White toothpaste. We have this, <laughs> is like the best thing ever to bring to Disney. This is Lana Kane Anti-Chafing Gel. And my God, if you're gonna wear shorts or skirts whilst you're at Disney, and you're gonna walk like 20,000 steps a day, you need this. Um, then Nivea Sun Protect and Refresh SPF 30 Sun Cream. We'll just move around here because I'm getting a bit of backache. There we go, we'll kneel down. Oh, there we go, that's better. Um, then for um, our little bit of first aid, we've got Nurofen Maximum Strength Migraine Pain because I do get migraines sometimes. Got Ibuprofen, Paracetamol, and uh, Pyrites Allergy Relief because Matt does get hay fever. Um, then, of course, I've got my feminine hygiene things. I've brought like loads because I just think, you know, better safe than sorry and I'd rather have way too many and not need any of them rather than really, really need them and not have any at all. Um, so quickly I'll just move on to my hair accessories. I do need to get some more jewellery out. So far I've literally just got this little necklace out. Like usually I don't really wear a lot of jewellery for Disney because if you're going on rides it's going to fling in your face and everything and I just put a little bit in anyway because I just like to have an option. Um, hairbrush. We have two black ribbons and all these ribbons are from glossy boxes. Um, we've got two black ribbons which I'll use if I'm going to have like um, space buns or um, pigtails. Then I have this little uh, polka dot pink headband which I think is really cute. Then we have one right ribbon which I'll use for a ponytail. Then this silk scarf headband which I do actually wear like as you would wear this. I wear it um, to tie around like a half up half down kind of style and it's kind of like 80s and it's really cute. Um, then I have this little bad boy which is to pin my hair back when I wash my face. Then I have a bag full of bobbles. Now this was when I was um, blonde that I got all of these bobbles so let me try and open it for you. So as you can see in there pretty much all of those are blonde <laughs> but we've got a few black ones in there so it's okay but if I'm hiding them with the ribbons it doesn't matter if they're blonde um, and then pack it full of clips so that is everything now we're just moving on to clothes so we'll start with the underwear okay so we've got an extra cream bra because I've got quite a few white t-shirts so the red one won't work then I've got I won't go into detail but I've got eight different pairs of underwear just um, because I like to always have extra, so that's three extra pairs than I actually need. Then I've got a pair of 60 denier black tights, and these are 
just in case it gets a little bit cold. I'm actually going to put a pair of tights in my handbag um, when we're around the parks, just in case we don't decide to go back to the hotel, um, so that I can just put those on in the toilet if I need to. Um, we're actually like 15 minute walk away from the park itself, so it's not a problem if we do need to go back to the hotel, but I always like to like give myself that option. Uh, then I've also got a pack of 15 denier um, tights as well because they're a little bit thinner and maybe if I'm not just feeling too great that day I like to have a pair of tights on. Um, then I've got one, two, three pairs of trainer socks and then three pairs of these like little slippy on trainer socks which go really well with um, these type of dolly shoes. Then. I've got a long pair of pyjamas, but still really thin and lightweight, and these are from Primark. And then this cute, really, really cute daisy print, um, like, play suit pyjama set, which was from Sainsbury's. Then, in case it gets cold, I've got two different jumpers. So these are both the um, Disney World uh, spirit jerseys. So this is the Dapper Dan Yellow. Um, jersey and then this is the Briar Rose Gold jersey as well so I've got those two then moving on to jackets we've got our two Disney ponchos which we bought in Disney World but then never ended up using so they're all like properly flat pack and folded which is really really handy so we've got those then I brought myself a denim jacket and then a little pink blazer um it shouldn't be too cold but in the eventuality that it is very very cold then i will put the jumpers on underneath the denim jacket and i should be totally fine especially as um you know with if if it's raining or anything i can just pop one of these over anything that i wear then we go on to blouses so i've got this white blouse which is the over shoulder one that i showed you before then we've got another white blouse, which is the button down with large billowy sleeves, a rust coloured polka dot um, blouse, and then a white t-shirt. So that's four different tops. And we'll finally whew, move around to here. This is exhausting. There we go. Okay. Um, so I packed a few extra things which are on top, so I packed a pair of black leggings because you just never know and I wish so much the last time that I was there that I had a pair of thick black leggings, so I'm bringing those with us. Then we have this um, really, really thin white polka dot dress which I'm just bringing as an extra option. Okay, um, then we have these teal shorts which I showed you before with the like... Um, safari print scarf round and then these are my extra pair of trousers so these are like just a checked paper bag pair of trousers that are from Primark oh and these are from Sainsbury's and this was from Primark and these are from Primark then we have this denim paper bag skirt which I'm pretty sure is from I saw it first um, but clearly clearly that needs ironing I'm gonna iron everything before we go um, then I have this like yellow, green, um, midi, maxi button down dress and then these really comfortable, oh and this, this was from Sainsbury's, um, these really comfortable Palitzo black trousers which were from Primark and then finally we have this really funky coloured um, skirt which is what I was wearing at the beginning of this video. I'm not anymore, I'm in my sweatpants now. <laughs> um, and this was from Misguided. Okay, so that is everything. I don't think that that is too bad. Um, I'll see what it's going to look like um, in the suitcase itself. I'm going to bring a big suitcase for me and Matt to share. And then I'm bringing this little one here, which I'm going to put a few extra things in. And then um, if we buy anything, then, you know, things can, like, be stuffed into there. Um, because we just had one checked bag, and then we're just going to use this one as a um, hand luggage. Okay, so that is everything. I've just got a little list as well of the things I can't pack until the day of. So we've got toothbrush, makeup wipes, makeup and brushes, camera, camera batteries and chargers, 
SD cards, phone chargers, Fitbit chargers and pound coins for the airport um, for parking. So that is everything. So I hope you really, really enjoyed this video. Um, I've been working really, really hard this week. I've just finished university and I've been trying to get like loads and loads of videos pre-recorded, including this one as well. So I've still got another like six videos to edit before we go away. We're going away in like 36 hours. Um, so I've got a lot of work still to do, but I hope that you really enjoyed this video. And um, if you are interested in me doing any more, packing style videos, maybe doing um, a Disneyland Paris haul if I buy anything, um, any Disney tips or tricks that you'd like to see, anything at all Disney, I'm your girl. So um, I hope that you really enjoy this video, thank you so much for watching, if you are new please don't forget to like and subscribe, I would really greatly appreciate it, and thank you again, all my love, sincerely Sophie.